My name is uh, Pedro Garcia. I'm a strength and conditioning coach for Jaime. And I work with Freddie Roach and most of his fighters. From the first day we came out here, you know, he it was, it took him a little longer. You know, he's a big guy, strong. So um, his, you know, also weight and stuff. So now his speed has gotten a lot faster. His times are faster, his recovery is faster. We're able to still do work while he recovers. You know, and that was a big thing for him is to be able to recover after getting your heart rate up. And um, it's like in a fight, you know, you go all out 10 seconds, you got to move and recover. So we're just trying to get him to a point where he can recover uh, faster. From where we're at now, he's been a, a big improvement. You can see physically, he looks really strong. He looks good. And you know, I'm really happy with the work. I'm really happy uh, with his work ethic and, and he makes everything easy. You know, when you have somebody who works hard, you know, you don't have to sit there and convince him to do something for himself. You know, he's ready to go. You just tell me how many, how long, what's my recovery, and you just blow the whistle and I'm right back at it. When I first got him, there was a big article out about like how uh, poor his defense is and so forth. And I said, they don't know what the hell they're talking about. And that's what he has. And uh, I think he's going to take it, take it to the next opponents. And uh, that's why I'm very, very confident in winning another world title. And uh, I can't wait. Some guys hit hard, some guys don't, you know, like, yeah, like Manny Pacquiao was a hard hitter, but he, you know, he, was, a, he was a small person in the latest. But this guy is a big guy that hits hard and with both hands. So it makes me a little bit nervous. And, uh, you know, that left hook is right on the money every time. He means right there. He's really high, high up there, and uh, I think he's my next world champion. And uh, we've had like 43 so far, and he'll be 44. <laughs>